Welcome back, everybody, uh, to Portal 2. Last time, we managed to escape Gladys, and now we are running with the Wheatley. Running with the Wheatleys. And if you're wondering... Oh, jeez. And if you're wondering why I'm so much more bombastic than I was before, it's because when I was playing the first five parts, I was doing it at 3 in the morning with my parents' bedroom, like, right next to me. And jump. Okay. I don't see where- there he is. So we follow Wheatley along the rail, and I'm assuming once we get out of here... I don't know if I was supposed to, like, destroy that, but I could just run through it. Wheatley, don't leave me! Oh god, oh god, oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! What's going on? Everything's dying! Everything's collapsing! Oh. That's some Indiana Jones shit right there. Holy crap. Ooh. It's not very often I could sigh a breath of relief. But here I shall. In this tiny room. I thought Gladys could just, like, neurotoxin the entire place. Why doesn't she just get me while I'm loading? Or does the passage of time not work that way? Chapter 5, The Escape. Oh, no. Get out of here. Whoa. Ah, oh, brilliant. You made it through. Well done. Okay, follow me. We've still got work to do. At least, what's happening? Um, oh, God. Hmm. What's oh. you doing? Okay, d uh, no. Move. move. What's happening? Okay, alright, so, I've got an idea, but it is bloody dangerous. Okay. Here we go. Ah! Oh, just the light? Oh, for God's sake, they told me that if I ever turned this flashlight on, I would die. They told me that about everything. I mean, I, I don't even know why they bothered giving me this stuff if they didn't want me to use it. It's pointless. Your, your plan was a flashlight. Ooh, it's dark down here, isn't it? They say that the old caretaker of this place went absolutely crazy. Oh. Chopped up his entire staff of robots. All of them robots. They say at night you could still hear the screams of their replicas. All of them functionally indistinguishable from the originals. No memory of the incident. Nobody knows what they're screaming about. Absolutely terrifying. Though obviously not paranormal in any meaningful way. Shut up. You're scaring me. Careful, careful. Wait, careful. Let me light this jump for you. I don't need your light. I'm still mad at you. This looks dangerous. I'll hold the light steady. Oh, nicely done. Alright. Quick, this way. Oh god! Oh god! Well, that, uh... Happened. All right. Careful, careful. Oh, I gotta. Wait, careful. Okay, Let jump. Me this jump for you. Move, move, move. Okay, this looks dangerous. I'll hold the light steady. Oh, nicely done. Okay, don't cut me up, lasers. There we go. I almost got a job down here in manufacturing. Really? But uh, guess who the foreman went with? Who? Only an exact duplicate of himself. Ah, nepotism. Wow. Ended up giving me the worst possible job, tending to all the smelly humans. Yeah, it sucks. What? Wait a minute. Sorry, that's uh, no, I was going to say smelly. Just, just attending to the humans. Sorry about that. that just, no, that just I attacked. shut up. A bit insensitive. Um, that, yes, that was incredibly insensitive. We've got to get you out of that room. Can you reach that wall back there? There it is. Oh, I'll tell you. Humans? Oh, love them. Just the mm. way they look. It's great. And their folklore. Yeah, we have great folklore. Colorful. Respect it, motherfucker. God. Such a bitch. Such a bitch, Wheatley. Right. Well. 
team gonna take this rail down the back. Oh god. See you at the ball. Good luck. Oh god! Oh. Give me a heart attack, why don't you? Alright, so. I think I'm gonna break up with Wheatley. The marriage thing was a good idea at first, but uh, now he's just kind of getting annoying. I hope he takes it alright. Huh. Okay, so we're escaping. No. Turret redemption lines active. Oh, it's actually a very. Let's see. There's an interesting little tidbit on this uh, on this part. Turret redemption lines are not rides. Let's see, Please was it exit the turret redemption line? Was it on here? Or was it on a different conveyor belt? It was on this one up here. Okay, so you come up here, and you see that turret over there. If you have never played through this game, or if you have, actually more likely if you have, this turret actually spoils the entire game for you. Through foreshadowing. See, so you just said get- Yep, don't make lemonade. You'll hear all this later. Prometheus was punished by the gods for giving the gift of knowledge to man. He was cast into the bowels of the earth and kept by things. Let's see, what else do you say? Be it won't be enough. The answer is beneath us. The answer is beneath us, that's also- yep. Alright. Oh, that is a huge one right there if you've never played this game. Oh god! Ah, they're too good at testing these things! Okay. This is the uh, the introduction of the uh, the crap turrets. <laughs> oh, I couldn't save him. I'll save the next one. Response. Come on. Template. Response. These effective turrets are hilarious. Response. Yeah, oh, brilliant! You made it through. Well done. Follow Tumblr. me. You're gonna love this. Wheatley, uh, we, we kind of need to talk. Da -da. Only the turret control center. Thank you very much. See that scanner out there, right? It's deciding which turrets to keep and which to toss, and it's using that master turret there as a template. Now, if, if we pull out the template Response. turret, it'll shut down the whole production line. All right. Right, um, hmm. I'm gonna have to hack the door so that we can get at it. All right. The call. Um, you'll need to turn around while I do. What? Uh, yeah, okay. Done. Hacked. Okay, go on, just pull that turret out. That was the worst hacking I've ever seen. Okay. Well, that should do it. Template missing. Continuing from memory. Oh, that's good. What, what, what do you have there? Template. Alright, so let's take our defective little friend here and make them all defective. They make a lot of defective turrets. Okay, keep your eye on the turret line. I'm gonna go and hack the door open. I don't have any bullets. Okay, I'm about to start hacking. It's a little bit more complicated than it looked from your side. It should take about ten minutes. Ah, one eye on the door. It's gonna take forever. Uh, you, you said ten minutes, right? This door's actually pretty complicated. Oh, how long's the door been open? Quite a while, actually. Was there any sort of announcement before it opened, like a, like a buzzer or an alarm of some kind, or like a hacker alert? No. I mean, you know, fair enough. The important thing is it's open, but just in, it's just mentioned in the future. God, I hate being brain damaged. I can only speak in my mind. So let's go and take care of that neurotoxin generator as well. And jump. I'm really good at jumping. Jump, jump. Bring your daughter to work day. That did not end well. I think there's an Easter egg and somewhere around here. Forty potato batteries. Embarrassing. I mean, I realize they're children, but still, you know, is it the low-hanging fruit? Or let's see, was it the big one? You can zoom in in this game. Oh, 
baking soda volcano. Well, you know, at least it's not a potato battery, I'll give it that, but it's not terrifically original, is it? You know what I mean? Not exactly primary research, even within the child sciences. Let's see. No. Look at that, it's growing right up into the I think the it ceiling. was this one, actually. The whole place is probably overrun with potatoes at this point, isn't it? At least you won't starve, though. Okay, apparently there's one of these that has Chell's name on it. Uh, I can't seem to find it, though. If you guys know, let me know in the comments. Uh, we're going this way. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we're going the right way, just to reassure you. Where Portal 1 was more about the uh, the puzzles and whatnot, this one uh, focuses much more on the story. Don't worry, I'm absolutely guaranteeing you 100% that it's this way. No, it's not this way. Uh, Fuck up. Okay, let's try this way. Open, just open the door. Yeah. How about that, huh? Alright. No Wheatley. No dialogue, so I can talk freely. God right damn it! This is the neurotoxin generator. Bit bigger than I expected. Uh, not gonna be able to just, you know, push it over. Have to apply some cleverness. There's some sort of control room up at the top. Just open the door, Wheatley. God, he's so annoying. I can't believe I was ever thinking of marrying him. Oh, the poor turrets. Oh! Oh! You doubted me! Alright. Uh, lasers! That's always tricky. Well, let's see, where are the more lasers? More lasers! No! Do you smell neurotoxin? Hold on, the neurotoxin levels are going down! Hold on, something's wrong! Neurotoxin levels up to 50%! No, it's dang. Sorry, my mistake is... I, I, I meant to say it's dang 50%. Yeah! Good. In case of implosion, look directly at implosion. Neurotoxin at 0%, yes! Hold on. Neurotoxin pressure has reached dangerously unlethal levels. <laughs> dangerously unlethal. Whoa! Pipes collapsing and everything's gone to shit. The broken! We can ride it straight to her! What? No! I don't I, I don't want it's it's scary. I, I, I don't I don't want to Oh god! It is fun. You you believe them on everything, and you were wrong about everything. You're always wrong. I hate you. I, I didn't mean that. Holy crap! We should be getting close. Oh, I cannot wait to see the look on her face. No neurotoxin, no turrets. She'll never know what hit her. <laughs> Hold on, hold on, because I, I, I might not have thought this next part would be ah! well, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm going the wrong way! Good. Get to her! I'll find you! Shut up! Find her on my own. Okay. So I think... She's somewhere through here. Considering this is the only way I go, this is a very, very linear area. Shoot that. This. That door is not gonna open, so we jump down through here and... Okay. 
Gladys emergency shut down and cake dispensary. Okay, so next time we're gonna go shut down Gladys and get a hold of our cake. And I'm sure absolutely nothing will go wrong here. See you then.